I know why you're here. You want to see how Barakay is now. I am here. I got you. Hi, how are you all doing? My name is Brittle Babe and welcome to my channel. background, Baraka had closed on the year 2018 as mandated by our previous elected president, Mr. Duterte. Before the closure, Baraka was infamously known for the green algae lurking at the side of the beach and tourists were like flocking birds. Baraka is known for its party scene, loud club music, tribal bands, left and right acoustic players, fire dancers and vendors were all over the place. You can drink where you want, when you want to. It wasn't that too expensive back then, I would say. And fast forward to now, this is how it looks like. Basically, everything is regulated. Roads are paved, transfer options are now regulated, main transportation vehicle or electric cars or cabs. There are more restaurant choices from your different choice of cuisine from Chinese to Korean, Japanese, Mexican, American, Malay, Indian, Italian, German, Filipino, and a whole lot more. There are also too many hotels to choose from, budget ranging from 700 peso to a whopping 40k. There's Henan, Crimson, Shangri-La, Move and Take, Savoy, to name a few. Best deals can be found online, of course. Music is now slightly regulated also, I guess. Most of the music years back then were all out at the beach playing over each other. Now, most of the music are played indoors, which I think is better. People are also no longer allowed to drink or party at the beach. The island has positioned police officers all throughout the beach, as well as the main road. Sadly, one of the sought-after attractions, the fire dancers, they were shortly removed and not allowed to perform anymore. Fortunately, because of the performers' efforts to fight their right to work, they are now given again the license to showcase their talent but are also regulated. Sad to say, they can no longer freely perform at the beach, which was used to be one of the main attractions in the island. Beach activities won't be gone based on my experience from what we got ourselves eight years ago are still the same water activities that are currently operating now. To not make this video any longer, without any further ado, saving the best for last is none other than the beach. One big difference from before, in this present time, it is now cleaner. LG Baraka has hired beach cleaners and through this drive, they not only maintain the cleanliness of the beach, they also help the locals get jobs. Baraka has maintained its place as one of the renowned islands in the world. It has maintained its beauty and clearly, the island improved its town governance. Although some of us have our own share of bad experiences, at the end of the day, Barahai will always be one of the best locations in the world that showcases this gem before the day ends. And with that, to wrap up this video is none other than what everyone awaits at the end of every day, the Barahai Sunset. <music> Watching, follow and like my channel for more videos like this and if you have inquiries about the island let me know in the comment section below and I'll gladly answer them all for you again this is Brutal Babe follow me in my socials thank you all so much for watching <laughs>